It is about to get real for NVIDIA, guys. They're set to report earnings after the bell today, and their stock right now is down another 2% after yesterday's red day, which I believe at one point it was down around 6%. Let me see. We closed at on the 16th at about 725 and yesterday we got down a 675 almost 75 dollars per share so we were down almost 7 percent at one point yesterday which has to be one of the biggest red days in recent memory for nvidia right guys and again today we're down another two percent so overall from the highs which we hit 744 dollars a couple of days ago we are now down let's see probably around five six percent actually no wait a second more like eight and a half percent so yeah nvidia guys heading into these earnings they're almost in correction territory right and overall i mean yeah the uptrend is still holding but we're finally getting some selling which means are people getting a bit antsy here before earnings they're getting a little bit scared. Maybe numbers aren't going to be as great as expected. At some point, the gravy train is going um, to come to a halt. Not saying NVIDIA is going to crash or it's a bubble or anything like that. Uh, but we are going to see a pullback at some point. And it seems like some investors, some traders, at least in my opinion, are trying to get ahead of it. Now, the question is, are they going to? to be right are we gonna you know sell off like crazy after these earnings even more or are they going to regret it and uh you know maybe we see a huge move after the bell on nvidia here right it's uh, it's gonna be a tough one right and yesterday i talked to you guys about how i don't trade earnings ever anymore you know i don't buy calls i don't buy puts or i don't buy shares heading into earnings as a trader right i don't like doing that it's it's pretty much a gamble at this point right but this one, I'm not going to lie, I said this yesterday, I'll say it again, this one's tempting me, uh, you know, it's tempting me, especially now that we're selling off even more, um, again, down another 2% on top of the red from yesterday. Uh, but it's not coming down enough for me to actually pick up some shares or some calls or even uh, consider gambling on it quite yet. Maybe if it comes down even more over the next couple of hours, uh, maybe another $5, 10 $15 per share. Okay, maybe at that point um, I would consider it. But at this point, guys, we're still well above the 180 SMA. We're still clearly, um, you know, arguably overbought, right? So I'm going to be patient. I'm not going to do anything irrational right now, even, you know, even if, um, you know, we do see a huge move after the bell and I regret it. It is what it is. I'm not going to do anything crazy um, with NVIDIA quite yet, but it is quite interesting at these levels as, you know, again, it is finally seeing a pullback, the first major pullback of this year. And let's see, the, the recent pullback or the most recent pullback of this magnitude was probably in November where we went from 503 down to about, let's see, 450, which really wasn't anything crazy. It was about a 10% pullback. So it seems like here every so often, um, NVIDIA is pulling back 10, 15%. Looks like here uh, back in October, we went from 470 down to about 400. And mind you guys, NVIDIA was pretty flat for months. I mean, look, you guys can see the stock chart here. It was flat for months. I mean, you can see here clearly from pretty much all of August or uh, July rather into August, September, October, November, December. It was flat trading between 400 to about 500. Then we got into this year and obviously, boom, um, it took off. So where would a healthy spot for a pullback be? probably anywhere between five to six hundred bucks i know it's a wide range but 500 again was resistance all throughout july through um the beginning of this year so that'd be a spot that might act as support if this thing does pull back um you know 600 is right around the 180 sma on the four hour chart that could be another spot so five to six hundred bucks would be a spot where i would consider um, picking up a bunch of NVIDIA if it were to get there, which is a massive, massive if at this point. We don't know exactly, obviously, um, what's going to happen. But, yeah, you know, it's pulling back, which is good. You know, it's 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 healthy to see pullbacks like these guys. So, again, earnings are after the bell. Let me pull up Safari so I can show you guys some numbers here, some estimates when it comes to NVIDIA. So, right now, the market cap, is around 1.68 
trillion dollars. Let me actually zoom in a bit here um, so you guys can see. $1.68 trillion market cap. I think at the peak, it was over 1.8, maybe close to 1.9. Um, so almost a $2 trillion market cap. Cheers to that, guys. Unbelievable. And yeah, at this point, um, they pay a dividend, which is pretty useless. Honestly, what's the point of this? I mean, 16 cent dividend. <laughs> it's like, why? Why are they doing that? It's a 0.02% dividend. I mean, you might as well just get rid of that. Uh, the PE ratio is at an 89.85. So it's a 90 P ratio, which I mean, guys, look for the growth that NVIDIA has seen. That's arguably justifiable at this point. I think last year they did in the same quarter, you know, they did what, $6 billion? We'll see right now. We'll, we'll pop this analysis tab up. We'll see right now. It looks like last year, um, let's see the revenue. Yeah, they did $6 billion. Think about this, guys. $6 billion of sales last year in the same quarter. And now they're projected to do, on average, based on 35 analysts, $19 billion. So, yeah, 216% is the growth expected year over year. Um, so yeah, the P is pretty high, which makes sense considering the growth of over 200% when it comes to the top line. You know, don't forget the bottom line. I mean, look, average EPS for this quarter is looking to, you know, be $4.30. The high estimates, 505. Uh, it looks like the lows, 402. And last year they did 88 cents of EPS. So year over year, guys, when it comes to EPS, Man, they are growing massively. And again, revenue. I mean, look, if they do the high estimate, $21.4 billion of revenue, NVIDIA is going to be, um, at the end of the day, growing well over 200%, 215, 220, over that year over year when it comes to revenue. So yeah, this is one that is for sure at the top of everybody's watch list. It's now become one of the biggest companies in the world. And uh, yeah, man, it's one that everybody's watching at this point, and I'm watching it too. And we're going to cover it later today as the earnings come out, not only here on YouTube, but on TikTok as well. Make sure you guys go follow me at Stas Talk Stocks and at Stas Surfest. I have two accounts on TikTok, again, at Stas Talk Stocks and at Stas Surfest. Make sure you guys go check those out. I think one of them's linked down below in the description box. So what are you guys doing? Do you guys own NVIDIA? Let me know in the comments. Are you buying right now on the dip? Are you holding through? earnings? Are you not in the stock at all, but you have FOMO? What, what are you going through right now? Let me know down below in the comments, guys. And this is in the midst of an overall red day again. NVIDIA is down 2% as all the indexes are in the red, building on the losses from yesterday. The Russell's down 0.6% right now. NASDAQ's down 06 S&P's down 02 Same with the Dow as the VIX is up 0.3%. Percent. So yeah, man, it's going to be an interesting next couple of hours to say the least. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. We're trying to get the 50,000 subs this year and you might as well get up to 15 stocks for Mumu, each up to $2,000 by using that link down below or by going to stocksurfest.com slash Mumu. Once you open up your account and fund it with at least 100 bucks, you get five stocks and fund your account with at least $1,000. You get 10 more stocks totaling 15 stocks and each of those could be valued up to two thousand dollars so get on it guys what are you waiting for use that momo link down below and with that being said cheers i'll catch you all later